In this video, on his 100th birthday, we are celebrating the accomplishments and contributions Dick Stevens and the Stevens Brothers Boat Building Company of Stockton have made to our maritime community. In an interview last year, when he was 99, he shared with us some great stories about running the yard. They just have, they have a charisma uh, coming, at, coming at you on the water that where did that come from? Where did that design come from? Was it the hull? Was it Jetson? Was it Whalen? Was it all the above? You? All of the above. Right. Team effort. Well, yeah. Somebody had an eye there, I'll tell you what. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we tried to, we tried to do it right. And if it was right, it was good. Yeah. Dick and his brothers spent most of their time hanging around the waterfront and the boat yard. I was at the, at the, at the yard. I, I wasn't uh, working there. I spent most of my time there anyway. So you just loved being in the yard, didn't you? You just liked being in the yard and working on the boats, yeah? Yeah. I grew up with was the uh, the boat boat skippers on the, on, on, on the boat. Sure, the, the skipper was skipper. Yeah. And another one that they come up regularly. Stevens Brothers Boat Building Company was mostly noted for their power boats, but they also built some exquisite sailboats. I. Uh, I made a model of the of the, of the Odyssey. Oh, did you? And yeah. it's in the uh, museum there. Uh, not the museum, but the club. Newport Harbor Yacht Club. I I built it for the uh, for the owner at, at the Harry at the time. Huh? Harry Steele. Yeah. 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 For '58, we built two boats, the John and the Odyssey. Same time, Jada. Yeah, Jada was a uh, was a uh, schooner, and she was a couple of feet shorter. I see in Jada's keels. There's a story about they were were they cast here? or They were cast in a. They were cast on the. Okay, because that was a big green sand foundry that cast steel, yeah, or iron. Yeah, they could cast anything. And then Odyssey was designed by E. Judson Kelly. Okay. By, uh, by, it was designed by us. He worked okay. for us, but uh, so E. Judson Kelly worked for us. But Judson Kelly. Right. So you would bring in outside designers to help you with the design. What's that? You would bring in outside designers to help you with the design work. Oh yeah. Yeah. But he was he. Was he designer or just draftsman? He, he, he did, did all, the, all the design work. Okay. But it was under our supervision. Right. And he was actually working for us. For us. Did you start sailing here on the Delta when you were a kid? Oh, yeah. I went through the whole routine. You did? Yeah. <laughs> With those little, what are they called? The I built Sunfish. it. Built Sunfishes. It, I built a 12 foot monotype, Olympic monotype. Oh, wow. Uh, when I was uh, 13. Did you do some racing? Every chance I had. Uh, <laughs> you a captain, or did you like to <laughs> get up on the foredeck and fly spinnaker, or? No, I was the boss. <laughs> <laughs> got it, got it, got it. No, so, I enjoyed sailing very much. Really, I, I, I so, bought a, uh, a Rhodes 33 and raced it for a number of years. Oh, wow. Because it had a good class in San Francisco on, yeah. on that boat, and then I thought I had to have a little bigger boat than I had. It. Nice. One of Dick's first commissions as he took over operations at the yard was this 48-foot tri-cabin cruiser. 
wasn't called Chan Enchantress. There was for those brothers, the brothers from Bakersfield. Bakersfield. The Berkeley brother? Berkeley yeah, brother. that's it. Yeah. yeah. Wasn't that the first boat you worked on when you came back? Yeah. 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 I wrote him a letter. <laughs> and he fell for it. <laughs> what yeah, that, that boat is that that boat's still in Southern California. It's in Bruce boat, right? Yeah, yeah, he's in. The, it's in the fleet. They call it Enchantress now. That, that yeah, I didn't recognize. It was the uh, tish tab. Tish tab. Yeah. Tish -tab. Which was bat shit spelled backwards. That's correct. Yeah. Bat shit <laughs> well, spelled backwards. Because they, they used the guano they, they, they for made, fertilizer. They made a lot of money on the fertilizer. fertilizer. They made a lot of money on fertilizer and took yeah. the money and bought a boat so really? they could escape Bakersfield, Button Willow. Yeah. Actually. Bat yeah. <laughs> button Willow and go to the. Button Willow, yeah. yeah. I've was, never heard of Button Willow before. Were willing to change anything that they wanted done, and, and we weren't building so many boats that it, it, it would make a difference. Chris Craft couldn't do that and still run a production line. Right. The Stevens Brothers Boat Building Company built custom pleasure craft, and they would accommodate changes within reason. Right. And the reason he kept building yeah. boats because he wanted to do, do it a certain way. <laughs> and he enjoyed it. And I thought that he did it just to torment me. <laughs> <laughs> but he, uh, so he, he liked to micromanage the project? Mm -hmm. He liked to micromanage the project? Yeah. Yeah. He, he didn't do much, man. He, <laughs> not, 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 nothing. Well, like, you know. He, he, in the in the in the back galley, he didn't he, he didn't want any built-in uh, appliances and this, like a stove or anything like that. It's kind of he odd. Just in one, yeah. 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 Did, did he buy more Stevens than anybody else? Yeah. Six. He had six. He built one that I, I said. Leo, you know, I mean. Thing is, the boats that make them hard to sit, hard to resell, and so I got them to build one just like I wanted it, and that lasted about a year. <laughs> <laughs> they hired experts to go out and get a company for them. Dick sold the company for a short time to try to bring new life into it. At that time, he, yeah. He must have wanted to diversify yeah, his yeah. business portfolio. Yeah, he bought the uh, he bought the Queen Mary too. Might as well. <laughs> <laughs> so the yard, yeah. you, you still worked there, and yeah, the yard we, just we, carried we on. Worked on. Uh, yeah. He only owned us for uh, I think it was about two years. Right. Good. It, you know, it wasn't. Uh, a real money-making proposition the way he wanted it. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. So he learned something. But he, yeah. but he was very fair with, fair, fair with it. The transactions and all that. So we bought it back for a discount. <laughs> who were your biggest competitors at that time? Who, were, who, who did Stevens compete with in the business? Oh, all of them really. Chris Kraft. Mm -hmm. Chris Kraft. Chris Kraft. Probably a hunter. Right. You competed with everything new that came out. Sure. Went through that time and we, we couldn't figure out what the inside of those those Manel tanks looked like. And Dick got on the phone with the, the, the fuel polisher who was trying to trying to polish the fuel uh, in the yeah. tanks and clean the tanks out and told them what the inside of the tanks looked like because they used to get Manel in rolls, right? And then they build those tanks, weld them all together, and all that kind of thing. So Dick remembered what the inside of the tanks, the bevels, and all those things looked like. It was yeah. just kind of a. What, what, what was the last boat filled? Huh? What? I would think you already know that. It's about 1,200. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. Yeah. That sounds more closer. The yard shut down in 1987, one of the oldest continually operating boat yards in the country. People that buy our old boats and rebuild them and ask a lot of questions. <laughs> yeah, you need, you need to pass that that's, off on someone. That's, right? that's, why, that's why I turned it all over to the okay. museum. The legacy of Dick Stevens and his family will live on through the boats they built, the Hagen Museum, and the Maritime Preservation Trust. Happy birthday, Dick Stevens. <laughs>